I've been trying to give you all this, but finally, he is here. Salutations, my people. You're watching ARTV. I go by the name of Tay Chaplin, content creator, AV God, social supreme, and this is Bands with Tay. It's been a minute. I've been trying to give you all this, but finally, he is here. I am with the footwork crooner, Pretty Boy D.O. Round of applause, people. Yeah. 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 Yo, my dude. Bro, thank you for man. having me, man. Oh, man, a pleasure, man. The, but you've been busy. Uh, we did work. Oh. You've been up and down. We did work. A lot of tickets, yeah? A lot of things, but we did here yeah, in the building. Aristocrat TV, Bass with Tay, you already know what time. You know what it is, you know what it is. First of all, I like to say, like, I, I feel like it's very trash when they say um, footwork crooner. <laughs> and it's yeah. like your latest jam, crooner. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, how would you define yourself? Define myself. I'm a man of many talents. Okay. Pretty boy, deal. In, in terms of music, I'm just. um. I come with the vibes, man. Okay. The new new age Nigerian vibes. I don't see new age as per new age. I just feel like I'm a young star. You know, I grew up on Nigerian music, American music, Jamaica music, all types of music, and I just fuse it into this sound. This it's like a plethora of vibes. Yes. Those like vibes. all together. Yes. So, like in the show, normally what we do is that we have like different segments. Yes. Normally we just go through like what's been happening, like normal bands, and mm -hmm. then we go into the music bands. Yes. So we're going to talk to you real quick, um, but before we do, um, let's just talk about what's been happening. Do you mind talking mm -hmm. with us? Yes, no, I'll go yeah, no. Okay, I know my now. Let's, let's <laughs> see what it is. So, um, how do you feel about Copy's work? Copy's work? The, the, yeah. the song. The song. I actually like the song. I swear, I even tweeted that I like it. I don't know why people are bullying her online. Stop That's bullying copy, man. Free copy, like she said. I actually like this the song. I feel like what she was going for, she she featured the Scooky. Scooky, Scooky. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I love mad, like, club jams. That's that get people dancing. And I feel that's the feel she was going for. Yeah. The workout video is like a sexy video. I like that. To be honest, the video that she has that I laughed at. Do you think she's sexy? Free copy? Yeah. I think, I think she's pretty. I, 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 <laughs> but to be honest, you know, she is sexy, like, you know, but I just think she's sexy, she's a normal baby. Like, Do you know what I think about Copy, right? I think Copy is one of those babes that she is kind of coming into her, her, her self, you know yeah, what I mean? Because yeah, yeah, yeah. even like, to be honest, I'm a cupcake, that's like what <laughs> but, I'm a but cupcake, they, yeah. because like green light was lit. Uh -huh. You know what yeah, I mean? With techno. Um, with techno. Yeah. Um, what was the other one with Sakode? Yeah, the yeah. vibe one. The vibe that, one. Was that was lit. That was nice. Cool, yeah. um, that was one with um, LA. The, the one with LA, not particular, not a big fan yeah, of that, yeah, one. Like that one. You know, um, but this is the thing. I feel like people need to like kind of like coach her more. Or let her like, grow, right? Yeah, but like, yo, my nigga, do that take again. You understand? Yeah. Like, yo, you need to take it. Because you know, like. Well, do you know, I feel, I feel like if her, if her dad wasn't rich and she didn't say that line in that song, in the work song about if you know Sabi. I, mean, I would tell that you know that's like an easy target and she, she sort of made herself an easy target but yeah, i feel yeah, like yeah. if it was another person nobody would give it down i really like that song i think you know the performance that she's going for mm -hmm. probably not with the epic band but let's let's not like downplay the fact that she's also a human being yeah, and yeah, yeah. she can see the way things play out in the press yeah, so yeah. she might have made that for like us for to, to just laugh or something yeah, 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 yeah. it it's might have true. been for us but yeah yeah baby. she's not as bad as people say so i don't want to know so guys, um, we're going to be asked a couple of questions. Mm -hmm. If we fail to answer the question, hey. or we answer it wrong, we have to eat these hot wings and mm. take a shot of tequila. You ready? Mm. I'm ready. All right, let's go. Good let's luck, go, bro. Yeah. Good luck. Okay. What is the oldest functioning record label in Nigeria? Ha. Ha. Ah. Wait. No, no, no. I know. I know it's. I know it's Kenny's music. One. Is it right? So, it is. Okay, right. It is. We are not chopping now. Chopping it. Boom. We are not chopping it. He said he knows it. Kenny's. Yo. Wow, Kenny's music is too folks for you. Yeah, man. Who is the artist? Joel. Um, Joel, man. Joel, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. That's D1 and KK and D1. For, for a fact. Did you see Drake rapping in Spanish? Yeah. I feel he's trying to copy my boy Tori Lays, though. Tori Lays. That, that, that's that, deep. That's deep. I don't think that's, that's deep. deep. I, like Torino has the whole last like Latin. Latin he album. Dropped, he dropped something like 
a month or two months ago we were I remember. Thing. Yeah, we are Drake now goes on. I like Drake. Yeah, I know bad thing is like a culture war too. I'm just telling you the truth. Like yeah. Bad Bunny, the guy on that track, that's like yeah. the biggest Latin, one of the biggest Latin rappers. Like his videos, go, his videos are almost at one billion views. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So like, the guy, Drake knows what he's doing. He does. Let me tell you, like one of the biggest things that hurt my soul was that someone was like, "Yo, go listen to um, Madiba Rhythm." Was it? Was it Madiba Rhythm? And at the end, I just, I just, I just heard like in the background echoes, was like, "Yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah." I was like, "Yo." That's deep. That was Bonner, right? Eh? Yeah, 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 yeah. But he does that a lot, Draco. If you read about him, at least they say he does that a lot. There are a lot of conflicting reports about it. I've never met him. But what he did to Bonner was good. Bonner said that he wrote a whole last track or something. And he only right. used that. But even Wizzy too now. Even Wizzy did in one dance. I, I, I know, know Whiskey did that. Like, But, okay, let me ask you a question, right? As an artist that is basically on the cusp of, you know, mm -hmm. world domination now. Amen. You know, once you kind of get to that international level, mm -hmm. Don't you think that's kind of like a way to go to sustain the steam? Like, what do you mean, sorry? You know, you kind of get like younger artists. Mm -hmm. You tell them, okay, bring your ideas. You know, obviously, okay, I am okay. who I am. Okay, I know what then, you mean. Yeah. That's like they bring ideas and you, like what you're saying Drake did today. Yeah, you Drake them. Ha, me, I, can't, <laughs> I, I, wouldn't be, I wouldn't be happy if, if um, someone did that to me. Mm -hmm. So I wouldn't want to do that to someone. But you never know what he told them. You could have told them that that's what he wants to do. He wants to... Even I feel that's not what he told him. Yeah. You know, but I, I wouldn't, me as an artist, I wouldn't be happy if I spend time doing like a track for you and you're going to cut it and, and, and like the most of my voice. Yeah. Even if you're Drake, bro, I mean, like, when, when prior every artist, when they started, they thought they were the baddest. They yeah. were going to be the baddest mm -hmm. in the world as opposed. I feel like, but you know what? I don't think we see them born and took it personal. You know. No, you know that kind of thing. Just like you take the job and take it. Like you have to because and move. I mean, it's the game. It's you the know. Game, man. And at the end of the day, like when Whiskey went to Drake, it kind of blew him up a true, little bit. True, so you I'm know. Sure Same as Burner. Burner. You true. know. Even though that touched on it that Burner was wearing in that picture with Drake, like. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> the most famous Nigerian artist ever. Ever, fella now. Fella. Okay, now. You guys. You guys go chopping. Yeah. Go yeah. I want to ask you a question, right? We were just talking about something. Who do you feel is your top five? Niger wise. Niger, Bona. Bona one? Five, one, two, five. Okay, we are clear. Bona, 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 Bona. Bona, one, the cool, they may be busy. Damn, you said one. I that's personal, that's my personal. Techno 2 is very good, though. Okay. Let me see, let me. Right now, I also like Tenny a lot. Yo, I think Tenny is. Yo. I think Tenny is one of the kind. Is Tenny a blessing to the industry? She is. To like Nigeria because I feel she's gonna blow more than just Nigeria. You know, in a new song, yeah. she has a new song called Case. Yeah, you know, I, I saw Miss Elio liked, liked it too. Yeah, no Miss, way. I'm just so funny. I always used to say that she reminds me of Miss Elio. Like, I'll tell you, I feel bad I did tweet it because now it's like, if I say that now, it's like, yo, Miss Elio liked that tweet. Yo, that's dope. Yeah, you know, for me, it was just like, what killed me, like, this, like, today actually, I was watching the video, and then the video, she's like, what the hell are you waiting for? I'm like, kill me. That's what she, she it. Yeah, yeah, that's like part of the song. But now they call her like this. Even with you, I don't, I don't play with you. You don't play with you, But Bona has to be talked to just because he's saying it. He says a lot of things. Man, okay, wait. Deep things. What do you think about Jesse Jags? Yo, Jesse Jags, I used to... I don't really know where he is now, but then I used to listen to his stuff a lot. He, mm -hmm. He's also... But I don't... I wouldn't put him as in today. I'll put him more of like legend stuff. I was like, M.I. Got you. Jesse Jags. Jesse Jags was... It was dope too, and it's raw too. Man, when Chuck Boys were doing their thing, Chuck, ah, yo, is, anybody that is raw, like Bonner, man, you can't defeat them musically, mm. even when they go, they're too raw, like, too raw. It's not like, it's not learned. I don't think it's learned. You just have it in there. It's inbuilt in there, right? be like, Tony can just be talking, and she will start singing. Mm. And if she records that thing and she sings, it's a it's dope hit. track. Yeah. I'm sure of it. Whether people do not want to say it to whether they want to say it, I just know it's a dope ass track. So out of Brenna, 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 um, Tenny, uh, Wandy Cole, Cole. Wizzy. Wizzy. Yeah. Who are you getting a feature from first? Well, I wait. But now, well, I don't know because I don't really chase mm. features. It has to be organic, right? Organic, like whichever one God gives me, I'll get. But I feel like the easiest one for me to get can be probably Tenny because I, I see her sometimes mm -hmm. a lot. Because Bonner, I've been trying to get a feature for Bonner for a I don't lot. think Bonner is in the same place one day. Bonner. Huh. But, but I honestly don't think he's in the same place. Bonner said I should buzz his bodyguard. 
<laughs> well, I don't want to buzz. Like, I don't want it to be like if, if I can, by God's grace. Because I know the people who is always with around. Yeah. Like, even in Yaki said, the people who is around, those are my boys. But I can't force it. Sure, can't force I have, it. A, I have an idea for you. Mm -hmm. What you need to do is like, um, Brenna, Brenna is working with a, key, a few producers. Some, some mm -hmm. we were just talking about just now. Mm -hmm. You should, you should, you should work with those producers, mm -hmm. and then when you you're around him mm -hmm. and that producer, be like, yo, my guy, play that track. Play that track. And normally, I, I feel like you would just jump on it. Mention five record labels in Nigeria each. Um, uh, Aristocrat Records, Storm Records, <laughs> uh, uh, YBNL. Uh, what? I can see what you said, right? No. Play records, Maven, Kenny's music. You guys said Kenny's, nobody. No. Brad, what is that? How that tell? How that tell? So one. Okay, I'm just gonna grab a wing. Damn. Is this spicy? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Please don't cry. No, I'm not spicy, shot. I mean, hope not that spicy. He's gonna be hot. Can we get some? Can we get some water around here? Come on, go that sweating. It's hot to be. I can't lie. To <laughs> Oh shit! <laughs> okay. Mm. <laughs> Everything pretty. Everything pretty is too hot. Mm. Oh, you <laughs> <my God>. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> so, um, bro, I have to be honest, right? Mm -hmm. The first time I heard you knowingly was footwork, right? Yeah. The first thing I realized was that I, I, w I, w I didn't hear. Like your lyrics. Mm -hmm. Let me not say I didn't hear it, right? I wasn't focused on your lyrics because mm -hmm. I was more focused on the vibe, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Very fresh, very new. How did you come up with that song? Um, basically, I used to say the, the word footwork just as a joke. Mm -hmm. Footwork. Like it was like my lamba. So I come back to the court to my boy July Drum as a producer. I like, yo, that your footwork. You should make it a song. Just say it three times. Footwork, footwork, footwork. So we played a beat. We recorded the jam. Like really, I like the first line to the first chorus. And I think a verse. Mm -hmm. But we left that out because we did another song called Bon Vita. So I thought about, I like that Bon Vita so much. Even mm -hmm. more than footwork at the time. But my manager kept telling me that, yo, this footwork, release this jam, DJs will like it. So we dropped the Bon Vita jam first. Then the name, towards December, like November, we dropped footwork. So when we dropped footwork, everybody liked the song. Yo. Everybody. Like yo, it blew up. It blew up. Sort of. You did, um, was it Giddy Fest? Yeah, I did get it first. Yeah, that was yeah. in February or March. Yeah. When you have great energy now. Bro, that one, that was the first time I ever performed Chopeu. Yeah. Man. Chopeu, and I had to make sure it entered. Because even the sound, the sound was fucked up. Mm. The sound was messed up. So I was t telling my, my manager, he was telling me, he wanted me to do footwork first, that people know footwork, mm -hmm. they do Chopeu. Told him, no, that I must do Chopeu second, because we just released it, and I wanted yeah. to enter. And at that time, when we just released the song, you know, like footwork was the song I dropped just before Chopper Brown. A lot of people knew footwork. It's like mm -hmm. that's what blew me. Some mm -hmm. people didn't know. A lot of people never knew I existed until mm -hmm. they heard footwork. This is true. You get so like mm -hmm. before I dropped Chopper, people were telling me like, "Yo, don't drop this song." Drop. But I wanted to drop that song because that's where I was mentally. Police have been stopping me. And then you guess the song. So counting my blessings, I'm feeling special. Skepta, bad energy. Cheers! Don't play with me, boy! <laughs> so you had a listening session? Yeah. That was like, for the tape, that was like September. This tape was about to come out on the first, so I was already telling a couple people that we had to clear a jam, and we also had to do the distribution. Well, because of that, <laughs> it's a big thing for me. This is my first ever tape. I really wanted to go as far as it can go. Mm -hmm. It was going to come out soon, like in my prior two three weeks, three weeks later, because I don't know, whenever we submit it to Tune Core and whatever date it comes out with this, mm. is when we drop it. It's going to drop. Man, I'm expecting some fire from you, man. Bro, you're fire. You know, and I think we were having a conversation before we started the interview, and I was saying that, um, I was like, I don't, I removed the word blow mm -hmm. from your career because, mm -hmm. you know, the way you're moving, 
-hmm. you know, it, 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 it shows that you kind of care about the music, mm -hmm. but you also know what you're doing, mm -hmm. you know? So it's like, it, it feels very organic, the way you dropped footwork, the way you dropped Chop Elbow, mm -hmm. and then obviously your latest track, Itty Bitty, Itty Bitty mm -hmm. which put me in trouble with my mom. <laughs> Thanks, bro. Why? Um, I played the watch, it was there now. <laughs> Yo, dope. Dope video, dope yeah. concept once again. Thank you. You know, is it, as you say, it's like it's all about your vibe. Yeah. How has the female, like, reaction been so far? For every track? Yeah. I'll say that, um, it was so funny. For something like activity that at least on my phone, I get more videos of guys. Oh, that's weird, man. That's so weird <laughs> to me, personally, because of what I'm saying, but I don't know, I feel like um, females, a large part of my music is females, like, yeah, is babes, I guess. Yeah, maybe I'll tell stories like that, but the story I don't really want to talk about, right? Is like because <laughs> I go through a lot of things, at least I feel mentally, I've been through a lot of things, just rise against, like, we all have to be the best versions of ourselves, right? I agree. I speak out, like, I don't, I'll never want to be timid, I want to say everything is like, I have a job, I say, like, uh, what did I say, Teleman, cool off. Tell a man pull up. Tell a man pull up if you wanna pull up. And if you wanna pull up, better make you shoot us. And if you're gonna shoot us, better make you kill us. Cause I'm my man ready. I'm my man ready. Mm. And it could get messy. Mm. She could get messy. You see, it's just like a, you, if you want to come out on site, you get what I'm saying, when you start trouble, eh? Huh. Better make you because <laughs> we don't look for trouble. If you come and find our trouble, we find it. And I feel like, look at Wizzy now, he's chilling, he's walking. But people mm -hmm. always come and find his trouble. Mm -hmm. But Wizzy will go and do love song, even if the song is a banger. Mm -hmm. That's not the kind of person I am. I'm more of like a burner that if, so, if anything is affecting his mind, he's going to speak about it yeah. on paper. Chop elbow, literally two days before I recorded Chop elbow, police stopped my car. I'm not lying. Every time I send that first verse, the only thing I change is, is weed. In fact, the only one Chop elbow I say, police stop my car, he can't seize my weed. And mm. beg officer, give me that's what they found, mm. and I gave them money. Mm. But bro, they found they found weed in my car, I gave them money. Why they keep the weed? They said it's evidence, evidence. But they had like three um grinders with them, they had paper. Oh. <laughs> they had this. Oh. I've seen, oh. bro, I've seen. Oh. Too, too many times back and forth. I didn't say it in the guy's accent or what. No, <laughs> if I do that, you know. You know. I'm away. This is the paper. Oh, fool too many times. <laughs> 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 okay, who is it? Bwana Boy. Bwana Boy. Frame me. Uh-uh. Oh, okay. Bwana Boy. Yeah, many guys. You should have done it fruit too many times back. You should have done it in the Bwana Boy voice. Please, please. <laughs> 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 Bwana Boy. 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 Bwana Yo, this has been Bounce with Tim. I'm going to name it Chaplin. I'm here with Pretty Boy D.O. Oh, yes. His brother drops everything pretty soon. Very, very soon. Wait. There's going to be a link of mine. <laughs> yeah, I really think all ways we hope, man. Yo, all ways, all ways. It's going to be a funny vibe, man. Salute. See you next time. Next time. Love. <laughs> Woo!